Superbike World Championship, also known as SBK, World Superbike, WSB, or WSBK, is a motorsport road racing series for modified production motorcycles also known as Superbike Racing. The championship was founded in 1988. The Superbike World Championship consists of a series of rounds held on permanent racing facilities. Each round has two full-length races and, from 2019, an additional 10-lap sprint race known as the Superpole Race. The results of all three races are combined to determine two annual world championships, one for riders and one for manufacturers. The motorcycles that race in the championship are tuned versions of motorcycles available for sale to the public, by contrast with MOTIP where purpose-built machines are used. MOTIP is the motorcycle world's equivalent of Formula One, whereas superbike racing is similar to sports car racing. Europe is Superbike World Championship's traditional center and leading market. However, rounds have been held in the United States, Malaysia, New Zealand, Canada, Japan, Australia, Russia, Qatar, Thailand, and South Africa and the series plans on keeping extra European circuits in rotation. An Indonesian race was also proposed for the 2008 season, but this was later cancelled by the FIM. The championship is regulated by the FIM, the international governing body of motorcycle racing. As of 2013 the championship is organized by Dorna. History The Superbike World Championship began in 1988, being open to modified versions of road bike models available to the public. For many years, the formula allowed for machines with 1,000cc V-twin engines principally Ducati, but later Aprilia and Honda to go up against the 750cc four-cylinder engines Honda, Yamaha, Kawasaki and Suzuki. For the first few seasons Honda won with the RC30, but gradually the twins got the upper hand. Using 1,000cc V-twin engines benefited Ducati and it was able to dominate the championship for many years, but the 750cc was second or third each year between 1994 and 1999. Held under the FIM, the Formula TT from 1977 to 1989 once constituted the official motorcycle World Cup. Having proven itself both popular and commercially viable, it was decided by the end of the 1990 season to end the Formula TT and the Superbike World Championship would succeed it. From 1993 to 1999 Carl Fogarty and Ducati dominated, Fogarty won the title a record four times and finished as runner-up twice on factory Ducatis. Troy Corsa also won the 1996 title and finished as runner-up in 1995, both times on a Ducati. Realizing that 1,000cc V-twin engines suited the superbike racing formula more, Honda introduced its own V-twin-powered motorcycle the VTR 1000 SPW in 2000. The result was clear right away as Colin Edwards won the championship in the bike's first year of competition. Ducati regained the title in 2001 with Troy Bayliss. Colin Edwards again reclaimed the title in 2002 on the same VTR 1000 SPW bike. Topic 2002. Colin Edwards won his second championship in what was arguably the most impressive comeback in the history of motorcycle racing. The season started with Troy Bayliss winning the first six races, and by the end of race one at WeatherTech Raceway Laguna Seca, he had 14 wins and was leading the championship by 58 points. Race 2 at WeatherTech Raceway Laguna Seca was the start of Colin Edwards' comeback. He went on to win all nine remaining races and, aided by a Race 2 crash for Bayliss at Assen, Edwards won the championship at the final race of the season at Amola. The final race of the season saw both riders fighting wheel to wheel for the entire race. The race is known by fans as the Showdown at Amola. The Manufacturers' Championship was won by Ducati. During these years the Superbike World Championship reached the zenith of its popularity, with global fan and full factory support. 2003 In 2003 the FIM changed the rules to allow 1,000cc machines twins, triples or four -cylinder to race. Rule changes in MOTEP to allow four-stroke engines meant that the Japanese manufacturers focused their resources there, leaving the Superbike World Championship with limited factory involvement only Ducati and Suzuki. 2003 also saw the entry of Carl Fogarty's Foggy Patronus FP1. 
The bike was developed under the previous regulations and was powered by a three-cylinder 900cc engine. With most of the field running Ducati motorcycles, the championship received the derogatory title, the Ducati Cup. The factory Ducati team entered the only two Ducati 999S in the field, taking 20 wins from 24 races in a season where all races were won by Ducati. Neil Hodgson won the title on a factory Ducati. Topic 2004. In an effort to create a more competitive field in 2004, organizers announced a series of changes to the championship. The most significant was that from 2004, the teams have had to run on Pirelli control or spec tires. The decision to award the control tire to Pirelli was controversial. The Pirelli tires were considered to be below the standard of Dunlop and Michelin that most of the teams had been using. Dunlop looked to take legal action against the decision while Pirelli claimed that Michelin and Dunlop were also asked if they would be interested in the one-make tire rule contract. Partly as a result of the control tires, Motorcycle Sports Manufacturer Association Aprilia, Ducati, Honda, Kawasaki, Suzuki and Yamaha announced that no MSMA teams would participate in the Superbike World Championship, later modifying their statement allowing Ducati to participate. A few privateers chose to run Japanese bikes in 2004. Ten Kate Honda with Chris Vermeulen as its rider, won races and actually contended for the title that eventually was won by James Toesland and Ducati. 2005 Following 10 Kate Honda's success Japanese motorcycles made a return in 2005 with major teams from all four Japanese manufacturers run through teams ran by European importers. Troy Corsa won the 2005 championship, giving Suzuki its first Superbike World Championship title. 2006 2006 saw the return of Australian Troy Bayliss to the Superbike World Championship after three years in Motip. The combination of Bayliss and Ducati proved unstoppable and they dominated the season, winning 12 races. Honda mounted James Toesland and Yamaha's Noriyuki Hugger battled for second with the British rider coming out on top. Defending champion Troy Corsa on a Suzuki was fourth. 2006 gave the feeling that the Superbike World Championship was back following the years of decline in 2003 and 2004. 2007 With motor machines reduced in capacity from 990 cc to an 800 cc maximum displacement, 1,000 cc superbikes, both at World Championship and Top National Championships (AMA Superbike and British Superbike), become the largest capacity bikes, but not the most powerful, being road raced in 2007. While superbikes remained two or more seconds per lap slower than motor bikes at most tracks where both raced, they had equal or more power. Troy Bayliss attempted to defend his title, riding once again a Ducati 999. Though 999 production ended in 2006 and the bike was replaced by the Ducati 1098, Ducati produced 150 limited edition 999S at an elevated race specification to satisfy homologation requirements. Bayliss' main rivals in his title defense included former Motop rider Max Biaggi riding a Suzuki, 2004 champion James Toesland riding a Honda and Noriyuki Hugger riding a Yamaha. The combination of some uneventful races in Motop and some exciting races in SBK saw the championship's popularity increase even more. The championship was won by James Toesland in the season's last race. His 415 points put him two points ahead of Noriyuki Hugger, with former Motop winner Max Biaggi following with 397 points on a Suzuki. 2008 After introducing the Ducati 1098 in 2007 powered by a 1,099cc V-twin engine Ducati requested that superbike rules be changed to allow V-twins of up to 1,200cc compete against 1,000cc four-cylinder bikes. Ducati argued that they no longer produced a road-going 1,000cc V-twin superbike and that the level of tuning now needed to make their 999 competitive on the race track was too expensive. 
Ducati said they would quit if the rules were not changed, while All-Star Suzuki team boss Francis Batter also said that his team would quit if the new rules gave Ducati an unfair advantage. The FIM eventually included the 1,200cc displacement limit for twins in the 2008 Superbike rules. According to the new rules, twin-cylinder motorcycles would be 6 kg heavier than four-cylinder machines 168 kg to 162 kg and would also have a 50 mm air restrictor fitted. The weight limit and the intake restrictor size of twin machines would be updated, if needed, during the championship. By a system analyzing the race points obtained, the new rules also changed the minimum number of bikes required to acquire homologation. For 2008 and 2009, all manufacturers, regardless of total production numbers, had to produce a minimum of 1,000 bikes to acquire homologation. From 2010 onwards, the minimum production number was increased to 3,000 bikes. In the past, smaller manufacturers were allowed to build as few as 150 bikes to meet the homologation requirements. Manufacturers took advantage of this by producing homologation specials, highly tuned versions of their road bikes with performance parts designed especially for racing. The 2008 SBK Championship was dominated by Troy Bayliss of Australia, on his Ducati 1098, who concluded his season and his career with a double win at the brand new, 195 million euro Portimao circuit in Portugal, after which he retired. Topic. 2009 During the off-season, Yamaha lost Noriyuki Haga to Ducati, who signed him to replace the retired Troy Bayliss. His place was taken by three times AMA champion Ben Spies, who was expected to give Haga serious competition. Ben Spies took a record 11 poles in the 14-round series and 14 wins 17 podiums in 28 races. His main rival Hugger was more consistent, finishing on the podium 19 times but winning only 8 races. 2009 also saw the debut of BMW and the return of Aprilia. Aprilia took a fourth final place in the championship with Max Biaggi, while BMW finished 13th with Troy Corsa. 2010 2009 champion Ben Spies moved to Motip. James Tosland returned to the championship after two seasons in Motip and took Spies' place at the Sterilgarda Yamaha World Superbike team, partnered by fellow Brit Cal Crutchlow. The factory Ducati team retained their two riders. The 2010 season started on February 28 at Phillip Island and ended on October 3 at Magni Corps. 2011 2012–2013 <laughs> 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 Topic twenty fifteen Topic twenty sixteen Topic twenty seventeen Topic twenty eighteen Topic twenty nineteen Topic Riders Riders from all over the world compete in the Superbike World Championship. The championship is perhaps most closely followed in Italy because of Ducati and the United Kingdom, where superbike racing has been the most popular form of motorcycle racing. National Championship Superbike Racing is conducted in several countries, including the United States, the UK and Japan. Riders from Australia and the United States have traditionally been successful in the World Championship. No American rider had won a race since Colin Edwards won the 2002 championship until Ben Spies joined the series in 2009, but no Americans competed in the series between 2003 and 2007. 
British rider Carl Fogarty had long been the most successful rider in the championship's history, winning the championship four times, and amassing a total of 59 race wins. Jonathan Ray cemented his overtaking of Fogarty in the history books by winning his fourth consecutive world championship title in 2018, amassing a new accord amount of race wins, too. Many riders successful in the Superbike World Championship have gone on to MOTIP, such as 2002 champion Colin Edwards, 2007 champion James Toesland, and 2005 runner-up Chris Vermolin. The championship has seen several former MOTIP riders move to it, usually after failing to earn competitive rides. The 2008 field includes five former MOTIP winners, Max Biaggi, Carlos Checa and Makoto Tamada all raced exclusively in MOTIP before joining SBK, while Troy Bayliss, Noriyuki Hugger, and Regis Laconi had alternating spells in both. Except for Frenchman Raymond Roche, who won the championship in 1990, all Superbike World Champions had been native English speakers, until Max Biaggi won the championship in 2010 and 2012 and also 2011 champion Carlos Checa and 2014 champion Sylvain Gintoli becoming the second Frenchman to take the title. Italian riders David Tardozzi and Marco Lucinelli won the first two races of the series, and Frenchman Adrian Marillas was also victorious in 1988. Germany had to wait for Max Neukirchner to achieve this in 2008, although Austrian Andreas Mecklau was the first German speaker to win a race, in 1993. Spain's first race winner was Ruben Zayas in 2001. Topic. Superbike motorcycles Superbike racing motorcycles are derived from standard production models. In the past, however, manufacturers took advantage of loopholes in the rules to create «homologation specials» motorcycles with low production numbers made especially for racing. Current SBK motorcycle manufacturers Aprilia, RSV Millar, RSV4 BMW Motorrad, S1000RR Yamaha, YZFR1 Bimota, Bimota YB4EI, Bimota SB8R, Bimota BB3 Ducati, 851, 888, 916, 996, 998, 999, 1098, 1198, 1199 Panigale R Honda, RC30, RC45, RC51, CBR1000 RR Kawasaki, GPX750R, ZXR750, ZX7RR, ZX1OR MV Agusta, MV Agusta F4 Suzuki, GSXR750, GSXR1000 Former SBK motorcycle manufacturers Benelli, Tornado Tray 900 EBR, EBR 1190RX Patronus, FP1 Yamaha, FZR750, YZF750, YZFR7 Race weekend Up to 2013 season Friday First free practice 60 minutes and first qualifying 60 minutes Saturday Second qualifying 60 minutes and second free practice 60 minutes the times of first and second qualifying are combined and the 15 fastest riders qualify for Superpole The rest receive a grid position based on lap time starting with 16th To qualify for the race riders must record a lap time no longer than 107% of the time recorded by the pole position rider Superpole's first 15 riders of the qualifying practice on the track participate in a knockout session. All sessions are 12 minutes each, with a 7-minute interval between sessions. The first round consists of 15 riders. The slowest three riders are eliminated and start 13th to 15th. The second round consists of 12 riders. The slowest three riders start 10th to 12th. The final round consists of 9 riders. The top 9 are set in this session. All times for riders advancing are wiped, requiring advancing riders to set a best time in every Superpole session in which they participate, starting grid. Sunday Warm-up 20 minutes Race 1 and Race 2 Race distance must be from a minimum of 90 km to a maximum of 110 km. Topic. 
Scoring system For the Manufacturers' Championship, only the highest finishing motorcycle by a particular manufacturer is awarded the points for that position, as in MOTIP and most other forms of motorcycle racing. Support classes Supersport World Championship Supersport World Championship has been a support class to the Superbike World Championship since 1990. To be eligible for World Supersport, a motorcycle must have a four-stroke engine of between 400 and 600 cc for four-cylinder, 500 and 675 cubic centimeters for triples and between 600 and 750 cc for twins and must satisfy the FIM homologation requirements. World Supersport regulations are much tighter than in World Superbike. The chassis of a supersport machine must remain largely as production, while engine tuning is possible, but tightly regulated. As in World Superbike a control tire is used, although supersport regulations dictate that the tires must be road legal and therefore race slicks are not allowed. A World Supersport race takes place at every World Superbike round. <laughs> FIM Superstock 1000 Cup The FIM Superstock 1000 Cup was a support class to the Superbike World Championship at the European Rounds. Motorcycles with the same displacement as Superbikes can run in Superstock 1000 though 1,200cc twins were allowed for 2007. Superstock rules are much more restrictive and most components on the bike remain stock. The bikes run on grooved Pirelli tires. The Superstock 1000 Championship is open to riders up to 24 years of age. Topic. European Superstock 600 Championship The Superstock 600 European Championship was a support class to the Superbike World Championship. The championship uses 600cc production motorcycles and is reserved for riders between 15 and 24 years of age. Same rules as Superstock 1000 apply, but the series is organized by FIM Europe. Topic. In other media As the World Superbike Championship has grown in popularity over the years, video games have been developed to incorporate its growing fan base. Originally EA Sports held the license to produce SBK Videos games until 2001 when they discontinued the series. SBK returned to video games in 2007 thanks to Italian publisher Black Bean Games, deal signed in 2006 via RTR Sports. Black Bean has realized three games to date with SBKX, Superbike World Championship being the latest installment of the series. <laughs> 